Don't the wealthy make it difficult for you, James says. Are they not the ones who drag you into court? Do they not insult your good name? And by implication, he's wanting his listeners to say, you know, come to think of it, they do. Then why, says James, do you grovel before them? Why do you give them that special place in your lives, that special power? They're just going to grab more. And in so doing, aren't you actually confusing them? If, if you treat them like gods, like superhuman, aren't you misleading them? Even as you're misleading yourself? Seminary, one of my professors said, always remember, No matter what folks think of you, you put your trousers on one leg at a time, just like they do. Greater than you, lesser than you, we're all human beings. Human beings who need God in our lives, who need to be encouraged to engage God's spirit and follow God's ways. So don't confuse people by treating them as something that they're not. Welcome them as friends. Be kind and considerate. But keep God in God's place in your life so that God can have God's place in theirs. This is Ben Moore from West Highlands United Methodist Church with a thought for your day, just another way of reaching out. Thank you.